Well, we now know when a small group of San Francisco students will be heading back to the classroom. KPIX 5's Juliet Goodrich with when the rest of the school district could follow suit. San Francisco school leaders announcing a reopening date, April 12th, more than a month away. And for parents like Jennifer Butterfoss, the announcement seems probably too little too late. Only a small number of students will be returning in the first phase. That means her son can go back. Her daughter will have to wait for phase two reopening end of April. Of course, parents are definitely frustrated. It's taken so long. Um, and there's still a lot of questions about which schools, which phase. And still no plan to bring back middle or high school students. We listened in on today's district-wide Zoom announcement. I also know that some students and families who want to return at this time would not be able to. Leaving out many students thousands. So we asked how many will be able to return. As we enter the back to school plan, how many students do you feel will be going back to school? We'll have better numbers for that, I would say after the end of this week, uh, but it's a couple thousand for sure coming back, have already committed to coming back for this first uh, return. It's, it's right? definitely a small number. Tired of the long, drawn out reopening process, Butterfoss is part of a parent group mobilizing against San Francisco's elected school board. I believe a lot of the decisions that they made um, haven't really been in the best interest of students and families. Um, we haven't seen a whole lot of accountability for some of the lack of focus that they've had on the priorities.